What's up, Flock Phoenix over here? Welcome back to another Farming Sim 17. Let's play a video. I guess let's talk. We're gonna be talking about FS9 19. Like, uh, that's what everybody wants to talk about. That's what everybody wants to talk about on Wednesday, or excuse me, Tuesday at least. I know this video is old, and there's people, you know, it's old news, and there's people that post all kinds of other things. But I wanted to give you guys, my subscribers, my uh, take on the trailer, and um. And talk about some things about it, and and from what I've read and all that good stuff. So uh, let's roll with the FS19 confirmed features video two. <laughs> so first things first. Um, still my favorite part of the trailer was the the song they used, uh, Clutch, amazing, and the I, I, it just it worked so well with the trailer, uh, Giants. You you have just the greatest music choice. Let me tell you that much. Absolutely amazing. But anyway, uh, so four seconds into it, uh, you got a blue truck. Very much looks like uh, maybe a, 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 a little bit of a modded. Of course, this isn't in-game footage. Um, this is all CGI. I just want to put it out there. A lot of people still don't understand that uh, Giants use CGI trailers to announce their games. It's not actual gameplay footage, but more than likely it's going to resemble the, the truck that we do get in, in the actual game. And uh, it looks, it's probably going to look just like the the older lizard truck that we already have because uh, it's very similar to it from at a distance. But uh, I don't know if that's the toolbox or the dog in the, in the bed of it. Now that I think about it, I was going to say that looks like a toolbox in the bed, but the dog pops up so I, th I think that might just be the dog sitting there um, but yeah uh, a beautiful landscape if that's the actual trailer the actual map we're gonna get so let's go to the next one that's eight seconds in there you see the little puppy pop his head up oh and they put a lot of emphasis on this dog like this dog has been featured a lot in the trailers so I'm I'm curious to see if we'll have like a dog maybe and options of you know options of dogs uh, maybe not just this one I'm curious if if we have options oh my god I'm running around with a poodle no I'm just kidding I, I <laughs> German Shepherd all the way dog 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 anyway um, just the puppy the puppy at eight seconds in he pops his head up from the back he's just, he's just adorable look at him you just want to pet his little head. Um, the next one up uh, at 13 seconds in, there is a for sale sign sold. Uh, while he's looking, at another good picture of the truck. Like I said, it looks like a, actually it looks more like an 80s like F-150 sitting there. Uh, actually, looks like a little bit of newer of a truck than the one we already have. But uh, a for sale sign, which makes me curious if we'll be able to buy like farms instead of just just fields if we'll get like farms uh, if so that would be freaking awesome if if we can actually buy like there's there's farm plots set up around that you can actually buy those instead of just the fields um, what was it Clover Creek had that option where you didn't buy the fields you bought the farms and you got all the fields around it uh, I like that idea so Giants if, if if that's not already on the list wink wink nudge nudge there you go um, so yeah, cool. uh, next one is the infamous John Deere shot when he opens up. Now uh, I got a comment on my last video is like, I bet you feel like an idiot. Why? Why would I feel like an idiot? I'm as excited as everybody else. Uh, this was not in the first trailer. If you actually watch watch the first trailer back, the tractor that they opened the door to had gray rims. They weren't yellow. Uh, and even Chief went back and watched it. And he's like, yeah, they're they're gray. So. Uh, this is a new addition to the game since that video. So no, I don't feel like an idiot. I am I'm overjoyed that we're actually going to get John Deere's in the base game. And I hope that they have as many options as the modded ones do, especially like the 8Rs that we have now. Uh, that would be amazing, Giants. Uh, they have it out there for you already. You, all you do is include it in the game. So think about that, Giants. Please. Pretty please. Uh, but... We're going to actually get John Deere. Um, this is something that like nobody saw coming. A lot of people thought it was like because John Deere's got their own farming simulator game. I, I don't I don't necessarily agree with that. Uh, I think John Deere's farming sim games are kind of outdated. 
uh, farming simulator is very much the top of its game and you know they keep topping themselves because they had to deliver something huge this time around with all the competition they got coming in now uh, so delivering John Deere was kudos kudos Giants you took my breath away um, when they did this so thank you Giants thank you very very much thank you I got to I think that's what thank you means I think that's what that means anyway um, it is 8400R 8400R uh, just a quick quick glimpse of it on the side there that's pretty cool that's awesome. uh, the, the, actually what I'm most excited about uh, instead of just the John Deere is actually the horses and I'll get into it a little bit more uh, why I'm so excited for them uh, this shot was pretty cool to see in the trailer. The the, the horses uh, running alongside John Deere. That was that was actually pretty cool uh, to see. But I'll tell you why I'm so excited about the horses in just a few minutes because it actually it didn't show it in the video. It actually comes from Giants' their, their, the blog post or whatever you want to call it. So uh, yeah, there you go. Uh, but there's there's a couple different colors actually. The one on the uh, back right seems to be a little bit darker than the other two. The other two kind of match. Curious. Again, are we going to have color options? Make it happen, Giants. I want a black stallion. Can we get a unicorn, Giants? Can you can you make a, a, a like a rare unicorn? Anyway. Uh, <laughs> let's go to the next picture. Next picture is of the I'm, I don't know if this is going to be the uh, the, the final farm but it was kind of cool because the, the horses pop up on the the mountain and look down as the John Deere is making his passes with the cultivator um, but look at look at this if, if this is uh, a rendition of the map that we're getting look how big it is look how how much room you have look at all the different fields this is actually this is a step up from from previous in-game maps I, I'm, I'm liking it I'm hoping that this is a sign of what's to come uh, for the actual maps because we're getting two brand new maps we're getting a American map and a European map brand new and I think we're also going to get the uh, Brazilian map from the, the platinum edition I'm not sure uh, I have to look that up I think that's what they said we were getting but we're getting a brand new American map um, so fingers crossed that it is it's like this because I'd like I mean this reminds me of going down back roads in, in, in Delaware it, it really does it's flat you know you just got just, just random roads going here and it's pretty cool I like it I, I hope this I hope this is a a CGI version of what we actually get in game because I would be just super happy play on that for a couple months till cooler maps come out <sighs> the next cool thing that we're getting is uh well they didn't show it here but I mean pretty much confirmed it uh, with the case cotton harvester that the next thing the next crop we're gonna get is cotton yeah I have uh, I've been a fan of the cotton thing uh, there's not many mods out for it, unfortunately, and the only map that it has on there that I really would want to play again is Mills County. Uh, so I want to add it to Mills County after we stop playing on it. And uh, this is going to be awesome that we actually get it in game and that you, know, you don't have to worry about an extra mod or anything. Oh, I am so happy. I'm so happy, Cotton. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. But uh, yeah, so that's that's a confirmed a new new crop. They also confirmed oats, I believe. Uh, that's in the blog post. And to top it, to finish it off, uh, they announced fall 2018. There's still no release date, uh, so fall begins in like October, doesn't it? So uh, definitely probably quarter four uh, of 2018. So we still we still got uh, a few months away we're still we're still a few months away from it but oh I'm so excited and of course that is the coolest thing of, of the trailer hands down electric worry by clutch such a great song I highly recommend you if you if you are into bluesy sounding like hard rock 
check out Clutch. They're 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 awesome. Great band from Maryland too, which is pretty awesome. Uh, so the next thing we have up here is the from the actual uh, farming sim website. Uh, they posted a, a post about or a news article about their uh, E3 reveal trailer. Farm Sim 19 unveil, unveils prestigious new brand and exciting new features in the new trailer. Um, so the a, I'll read it, I'll read the whole thing because it's pretty short. It says the largest agricultural machinery company in the world comes to Farm Sim 19. We're happy to finally unveil the highly anticipated John Deere brand, joining the largest gra- garage ever in Farm Sim. Later, in a Farming Simulator game, Farming Simulator 19 takes the biggest step forward yet with the franchise's most extensive vehicle roster ever. It will take control of vehicles and machines faithfully recreated from all the leading brands in the industry, such as Case International, or Case IH, uh, New Holland, Challenger, Fent, Massey Ferguson, Voltra, Dutzfar, Crone, and many more. We're also happy to welcome the world's largest ar- agricultural machinery company, John Deere. Brand rides with the iconic tractors such as the 8400R seen in today's trailer. So the only tractor confirmed for sure is the 8400. That's the only one that's confirmed so far. Um, I'm hoping we get like an 8370R um, and what's the other one I used a lot? The, the 7R. Um, was it was a 7310? 7310 is what I think I used. Uh, those those are ones that I've those are the, the two like iconic tractors um, that I've I've used throughout the whole farming sim sim my whole journey through farming sim as far back as thirteen uh, to now so uh, those are the ones I really hope are are in game to begin with so I don't have to wait for them uh, anyway let's go to the next paragraph farming simulator later farming simulator nineteen will feature New America and European environments in which to develop and expand your farm. Which makes me excited. Expand. Anyway, the game also introduces many new exciting farming activities, including new machinery and crops with cotton and oat. Cotton and oat new to new um, crops tend to your livestock of pigs, cows, sheep, and chickens, or ride your horses for the first time. The horses are going to be rideable, and they're not going to look like derpy, derpers and horses either, like we had have in currently as a mod. Uh, oh, it's so cool just to ride your horse around your farm. Oh, that's gonna that's that's why the horses it, it puts the biggest smile on my face. Just just the 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 Kella Dude Ranch rides again, man. Right from the beginning too. It's gonna be great. Uh, letting you explore in a brand new way in a vast land around your farm. Farming Sim 19 will be available fall 2018 on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC and Mac. Um, so last, the last four images here, uh, we're going to have one of the Fent, what's it, Ideal? Ideal? Is it? it looks like it. It says Deal. I think there's an I before it. Uh, Harvester. Uh, it does look pretty cool. Uh, I still prefer John Deere make it happen let's get this s-series up in this this piece there um giants let's let's do this and then next picture is from the front the guy looks constipated as all get out but these are actually in-game pictures uh these are not the the cgi these are actually in-game pictures so keep that in mind what you're seeing is actually in-game just keep that in mind uh next we have a cool picture of the in-game 8400 uh just looks good it looks really good uh, and then next one up is probably everybody's favorite picture it has John Deere but looks like to be the Brent overloader I'm not sure it's on tracks uh, but it looks like it uh, and the trailer it looks a lot like the Wilson trailers uh, I'm not too fan of too big of a fan of the off-road wheels on it but uh, hopefully that's changeable hopefully that's changeable so that's the four the four newest pictures to come out of it uh, that's all the the current information uh, from from Tuesday's big reveal uh, there was another thing I come across that they said that there's a huge list of everything that that the, the game developers because the community and everything wanted on this new uh, farming sim game and they've actually gone down the list and tried 
you know, try each thing out and what, what works, they stick in, what doesn't work, they, they, they set off to the side. Um, a quick, quick, uh, rundown what I, what's left that I really want, uh, beef fattening, chicken fattening. Um, I wouldn't think it would be that hard, uh, since we already have pigs that, you know, you sell those for meat. Um, I don't think it would be that hard. I knew they got a lot of backlash from PETA when they put pigs in, so maybe that's why they're kind of, you know, holding back on us with the beef and chicken. But I, I really, as as a Eastern Shore feller, I really want chickens. I really want uh, to be able to sell chickens for for their meat. That that is that is one thing I that hasn't really been in mods, and I really would like to experience it. Same way with with beef I would, there was no beef that I know of in 17 they had it in 15 I don't know why it, it never happened in 17 because I think it would be easier to just use the in game scripts all you gotta do is switch the models around from pigs to cows um, not quite sure why why, why it, there nobody pulled the trigger on it uh, I would think it would be like I said easier um, giants help us out here man it was, it was some beef um other than that, I mean, there's really nothing else I would, I would really want in farm sim. I mean, if, once they get those two in there, I, I really, I, I wouldn't know where else to take it. Like, what else could we possibly like ask for? <laughs> I mean, the beauty of it is, is the, the beautiful thing of farming simulator is it's not it is a farming simulator. That is its main goal, um, but you can do so much more at Farm Simulator that makes it an all-around great simulator. Like we do, we do uh, fire stuff. There's people that do uh, mining. There's logging. There, there's all this, which makes it uh, such a great game. But none of that really fits into the farming simulator. Uh, the only thing they could possibly do is, is take it to like. Um, just a simulator just knock off farming and do every day everything you can think of simulator because it's basically what it's become uh, so I don't think we'll ever see um, ever see like the fire trucks and stuff be as be a default thing uh, I, I highly doubt it but I do in the future see um, you know the of course, the, the different options for for animals, uh, I'm, they still have plenty of crops to go through. I would like, okay, I would like to see what's in that Willow River farms, uh, like apple trees, maybe vineyards. Vineyards are a great idea. Uh, let's get like grapes so we can make wine. I, I'm pretty sure that wouldn't work because they'd have to put like they'd have to up the the rating on it because of the alcohol. Damn. Anything about that? Can we make it grape juice and just, just, just like as adults know it's wine? Can we can we do that, giant? <laughs> uh, can we make an adult version where we get to make whiskey, <laughs> whiskey and beer? Like, can, I mean, the options are, are endless when it comes to farming. There's so much good stuff that we that could come from it. Uh, I think they're more limited on like the age rating for stuff like that, but uh, I'm excited for it. I know as soon as they announce a pre-order, uh, I'm pulling the trigger. I'll have it pre-ordered the day the pre-orders start. Um, I'm doing digital this time around. Screw waiting on UPS this time around. I'm not waiting. I, I will have the freaking digital download so night one I can stream it. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm not fooling around with physical copies anymore because... Oh, they're so aggravating. So, uh, I, I will definitely have it night one this time around, guys. I promise you that. But that is going to do it for today's video, guys. I hope you did enjoy the video. I hope you're as excited as for Farming Sim, or Farming Sim 19 as I am. Uh, still, I want to know what you guys would like to see. Uh, be a part of Farming... I'm not talking about, like, brands. Because... Um, We've got pretty much all the brands you can think of now. Uh, what else? What other crops would you like to see? What other um, productions would you like to see? Like, would you, would you like to see the the wine, the wineries, 
the breweries and stuff like that. What else? What other? Adam. Wow. Hello. I just lost my voice there for a second. Uh, what other animals would you like to see? There you go. Uh, I, I'm. Anyway, I'm too excited. I'm getting giddy. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video, guys. Uh, as always, guys. Thank you so very, very much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.